Hey guys and welcome to the first ever Mates Play. What this is going to be, like the title says, is where me and my mates play a game together. And this is going to be a Pokemon Nuzlocke versus. And what that means... What that means is that... We'll basically be playing a normal sort of Nuzlocke, except the difference will be... I will be doing mine on my channel, and they will be doing theirs on theirs. We're each going to have a different starter as well, and well, I hope it's going to go really well. I'll explain the rules as we go along once I actually get into it. Um, let's speak for a bit. Speedy, 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 speed. boy. And uh, let's see. Well, let's go with my namesake. Let's be called Duelist, I think. Right, Duelist. Oh good, dude, this is gonna say got worried about for a second it wouldn't. Um right, so that's that. Right, yep. Yeah. Right, um can't ask him the name so let's just call him Gary. Speed, 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 speed. Right, here we go. Right. The rules I'll i I'll stop in the house and tell you what rules we're gonna go by. Right, the rules of this Nuzlocke are First of all, you must nickname all your Pokemon. Number two, the first encounter you see in a route is your Pokemon for that route. If you kill it or don't catch it, you do not get it. Luckily though, we are using Duke Claw, so if you've already caught a Pokemon, you can choose for a redo on your route Pokemon. So that, I think, will be quite useful. Uh, we are also going to be using the rule that you can only have an event Pokemon if you have another catch in that route. So for example, where you get the Magikarp seller, if you've had a catch in that route already, you cannot have the Magikarp. Same with legendaries and well, that should be a, a quite useful rule because otherwise we're going to get two clock on Pokemon. Um, with me and my mates, we're going to be using also a point system where we all start on zero, minus one for every Pokemon you have to die, minus five if you restart. Once we all finish the game, and get past the Elite Four, we will check the scores, and whoever has low the not lowest score, the highest score technically, because obviously you want to be at, on zero ideally, will be the winner, and then we may take our Pokemon teams on showdown to see what happens there. Are there any rules I'm missing out? I don't think so, but if there are, we'll probably come across them as we go. One thing I will definitely do is go up to this um, PC, because I do believe there is a potion. I would be correct. I actually remember something about this game. Nothing. Um. One thing I will do actually, what I remember, is I'm going to upgrade the tech speed. Okay, no, I'm not because I pressed the wrong button. Right, fast. Um. Yeah, it's all fine. All right. Just check that. Save that. Yeah, did good. Right. Now the text is fast, so we should be able to do this a lot quicker. Also, I'm going to try and not use the speed button too much. I just used it in the intro there because that would have taken too long. Uh, this is mum, yeah, all the guys leave home someday, gotta go see Professor Oak. But luckily, I remember somewhat this game from playing it when I was a kid at the Game Boy Color. You need to just go straight up here. Oh, hey, wait, don't go out. It's unsafe. Wild Pokemon live in the grass. You need to open Pokemon for your protection. I know, follow me. Also, um, before I filmed this video, we all picked which start we were going for. Uh, my mate, NKO, is going to be using a Charmander. I'm going to actually be using Bulbasaur, which is different for me, because usually I go for the water guys. But my other mate was like really determined to have Squirtle, so I was like, alright, I'd actually like a change. So, I'm going to be going Bulbasaur for this, and we'll see how well it goes. Right, this one's Bulbasaur, right? Yeah, it is. Right, Bulbasaur. Yes, I would like you. I received the Bulbasaur! Hooray! Yes, like I said, we need to give nicknames to them. And, um, what should we call you? I think I'm going to name you after a reference from the internet comic Super Effective, since that is based in Pokemon. So we are going to call you Tentacles. There is enough room, right. Tentacles of Bulbasaur. And then Gary will take Charmander. There it is. Right, and now if I walk off 
a battle start. Here we go. Wait, do this. Let's fight. Right, the first fight. Let's see how well this will go. Right, let's do this tentacles. Yeah, I don't know about Pokemon battles. I really don't need this tutorial. I've played many Pokemon games. Right, tackle. That is a fair amount. Right, I'll choose ground later. I'm gonna, I'm gonna see what you can do. Tackle. Ow. I really don't want to have to use a potion, but I think I'm going to have to at this rate. Because I really wouldn't want to lose my first... Okay, I'm using a potion. I know about my Pokemon. Stop telling me I just want to use the potion. Thank you. Kind of sucks I had to use a potion immediately, but then Bulbasaur from my level doesn't have much of an attack. So I can understand why I had to... Um, ow. I took back again. Tackle. But like I said, I was kind of expecting Bulbasaur to like need to use the potion immediately because Bulbasaur isn't that great at attacking compared to Charmander. But hey, we won and we got a level, so it's all good. Good job, Tentacles. Right. He's gonna make his Pokemon battle. Just tough him up. Right, how do I heal? Oh yeah, I've got to go see my mother now. Right, got it. Let's go. One thing I will actually be speeding through is I'm gonna speed up to the assignment and stuff. Cause it will be quicker. And I don't really think you wanna kind of watch me walk all the way up there and then back and then up there again. So time for the speed. Problem is I can't control very well with speeding, so. Let's try to speed this up. So like I say, these are just wild battles. These are quite boring. Speed. Don't worry, guys. I am kind of keeping an eye on tentacles HP, so. Ooh, land easy already. Hooray! That's good news. Right, I believe there's a bloke nearby who will give me a potion. Oh, don't tell me it's that guy over there. I bet it is. Yo! Hooray! I don't really want to have to go all the way back to heal my bolt, my tentacles immediately, so let's just use the potion. I'll be able to buy more potions later, it'll be fine. Right, let's go. Oh, come on! Let's actually see how much this DC can do, so let's actually not, like, speed through this battle. Yeah, absorbing your soul, Pidgey! But this is quite useful because if I need to see like the beginning of my wild fights, I could I don't like need to potion as much, which would be nice. It's a nice feature. I think I'm definitely gonna keep Leech Seed as a move. Cause it's gonna be useful, I think. Walk for it. Do loop do walk do the walk. Oh it's a retardo. Right, we can speed for that because who the hell Oh come on! Do I think you've got enough health to continue? No, I do not. Run away! Let's look at Martin in this area. Not a bit. Right, go. But like I say, sorry for all the speeding, but, you know, it's the early bit. And nobody really wants to watch me walk to the mark, walk back, and then walk all the way back up here again. And we don't have running shoes, otherwise I would just run, but we don't have running shoes, so I have to use the speed button. Although, as I said, I'm trying to... I don't think I actually need to use the speed button for this walking back bit, because there are obviously these bits. The speed was just kind of to avoid the really annoying battles at the beginning that aren't important. I mean, they'd be important if it was like my first catch on the route, but it isn't yet. 
Because that will not come into effect until I have Pokeballs. Let's get the entrance bit, because I don't care. This is the last spell before we actually get our Pokedex, so let's just play this one. Also, it gets to level 8, which is quite nice. Oh yeah, look at that soul absorption. Come on, tentacles. I'm feeling confident. Not only in this battle, but in, ge in general, your chances. I mean, you're really good against the first two gyms, so I'm not having advantage there. I mean, you know, seriously. NKO is going for a Charmander. He is going to have to catch something quite nice to get over Brock, because I've already told him he's not allowed to sit at the start and grind his Charmander up to Charm Medium, which is what his intention was. I mean, I'm only fighting these wild guys because I might as well on the way. I'm not actually kind of purposely trying to grind. Do 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 Where the hell is put? There we go. But hopefully these episodes are going to like pick up in excitement once we actually kind of get the running shoes and we get doing something. Cause right, and catching guys, because right now it's like, you know, we've got to go for the storyline rubbish at the beginning. Yeah, just, actually screw it, let's speed this. Give me the Pokedex. Thank you, I have Pokeballs, all right. Right, since I'm speeding for that, I didn't read it properly. Um, okay, we do have Pokeballs. Right, the Nuzlocke begins. Let's just check if these aids give you anything, because I think in one of the older games they may have given you something, but they don't. It's fine. Alright, let's now go to Gary's house, get the town map, because otherwise I won't have it, and that would be a bad thing. Give me the map, woman! Thank you! Right, now let's go see if we can catch our first Pokemon on the route! Rooties! Um, right, come on, there we go, right, first Pokemon of the room is a Rotata, which I'm actually happy about, I mean, Raticate is probably one of my favourite normal, mon well, normal Pokemon, so, I'm actually going to be happy with this, and it's level 3, so it's not in a bad level. Oh, we're just using Tail Whip, right, if we attack him once more, I think, there we go, he's at low, right, we're going to throw a ball in a second, I think. Right, let's throw a ball! Go, Pokeball! Come on, Rattata! Get in the ball! Yes, I call a Rattata! Rattata is mine! Welcome to the team! Rattata! I have to give him a nickname, and I've already got a good idea of a name for him! Ah, oh. Ah, I've opened the help! Why did I do that? No, I don't want any help. Go away. Um. Oh, B button, right. Yeah, misclick the button there. Right. You're probably going to guess where I'm going with this. And we are going to call Ratata Jerry after the Tom and Jerry cartoon, because I used to love that as a kid. Um, let's keep going up here. Oh, I really should stop pressing the help button. Stupid layout. Um, In case we find anything on the way, let's get Rattata out front so we can start getting him some experience. And so he's basically just going to do the bait and switch tactic to level this Rattata. Me thinks. Go, Jimmy! Switch two tentacles! Ow. Take this! Right, we'll get some health back since this Pidgey isn't doing us some that much damage. It's doing like three damage. How much is this he gonna give us? Not much. But hey, uh, every little helps. Tackle. Ow. Damn it! How did you miss Tentacle with a Pidgey? Seriously, what are you doing? Yeah, I think we'll end this episode uh, when I, yeah, when I get the Viridian Forest. I wasn't sure what I was going to say that, but yeah, maybe, yeah, Viridian Forest I think is fine. I kind of want, I will kind of want to keep this first episode short so you all don't get bogged down by the storyline, rather. 
Well, that didn't take ages. Oh, yeah, but I mean, technicals, you get a freaking crit when we don't need it. Thanks, idiot. Right, let's go heal Jerry and tentacles, and then we shall see what we get on the other route. Because, of course, there is the um, route to the side of the Pokemon League. I'm not going to fight the. I'm not going to fight Gary, who's there. I might head back once I'm like done the Viridian Forest, but not right now because he's quite strong and he'll probably kill me. And I don't really want to be losing Pokemon this early on. I I really should stop pressing the help button. Eventually I'm going to remember that button is the help button. Right, because we're going to try and catch something, let's switch that there. Right, as I say, we're, we're not going to um, fight Gary, we're just going to go to this route. New route, of course, so we're going to catch a new poke. What can we get? Come on, something good. It's a attacker. Luckily, I can totally dupe claws it. I'm going to use the dupe claws. So I get to redo because Rattata is already owned by me. Ready game. Oh my god, that's level 5. Really, I should actually put my Rattata out front. Also, there's Jerry. Right, let's try again. Can we not get a dupe clause this time, please? Thanks. That would be super. Really? I'm starting to get annoyed now, so I'm about to kill this one just to kind of send a message to all the other Rattatas to go away. Because I'm sure there's more stuff in this area than just Rattatas. Taco! But seriously, these Rattatas, they are so annoying. I mean, as I say, I like Rattata, don't get me wrong, but I don't want to see like five of them. Um, I press that. I am so turning that button off, but I'm gonna disable that button for the next episode. Right, let's actually switch because that didn't go well. I'm gonna give it one more try, and if it fails again, I'm just gonna leave this area because screw it. I cannot be bothered. Okay, I can't be bothered. Fine. I won't get a root Pokemon. Fine. I don't want. I didn't even want a root Pokemon anyway. Fine. Screw you, Route 22. I can't be bothered with you anymore. Let's go find that old man and talk to him, and then he can teach us how to catch Pokemon, even though I already have a Rattata. Well, I think we're going right so far. Um, annoyingly, I have a... Uh, I didn't get anything on Route 22, because I couldn't be bothered to keep reduping. Stupid Rattatas. Let's heal up first. Yes, I would like you to heal my Pokemon, thank you. Right. Actually, let's end, I think we'll end on a nice little exciting bit, so let's, we'll end after I catch my Viridian Pokemon, I think, actually. Because if I ended just in Viridian Forest, that just, all you would have seen beforehand would be about this bloke, and that would be boring. Great, he's going to teach us how to catch Pokemon, even though we already know how to. Actually, go to speed this. I forgot about the speed button. Because I think that'd be better than listening to the old man for 10 years. Right, bye, loser. Route 2, this is a new route, if I'm correct, but I don't know if there's any grass. There is grass. Ooh. Right, let's see what we get. Really? I guess we might as well bait and switch, get Jerry up to level 4, I suppose, while we're here. I mean, seriously, what is it with Rattata? I mean, am I the Rat King or something? Am I like your Pied Piper or something? Am I that guy who all of you are attracted to for some reason? Apparently so. I 
I don't know. Oh, good job, Temples. Oh, that did a lot of me, though. But luckily, we have Link Seed, so we're getting some of it back. Ooh, we're getting two back. That's nice. Die, Rotata. Ah, well, it's dead off in this Link Seed. So that's fine. Yeah, take that, you punk anarchist. Woo, Jerry's level 4. Tentacles get some experience. Um, I, yet again, cannot be bothered. I don't need that many people in my team, so let's just leave that. Fruit of Rhythm Forest. Right, let's see what we get. Let's just quickly see what we can ground. I know what I want, I know what I want. Yes, it's a wheel. Just to explain, of the two Cappy and Weedle, I, I know Beaver isn't great, but I love Weedle. Like, I prefer it so much more to Black 3, so I'm really glad my first guy I've seen is a Weedle. Right, let's catch him. Come on, Weedle. Yes! Right, we have him. Nickname. Hmm. Oh, I know what we're going to call you based on your evolution. Where is it? Right, Giga. Oh god, I can't have space. Um, there we are. Ah, I'll play, there we go. Some of you probably already figured out what I'm going for here. You know, he's going to be called Giga Drill. Oh, I'll open that again. Wow, there are two buttons that the help menu. That's irritating. I'll have to disable those. Right, let's quickly have a look at our natures, then we'll end here, I think. So lonely. I don't know what that means. She's timid, and we have Giga Drill. Hmm, I don't even know which one of them I really want to level. Probably. Yeah, probably Giga Drill, because he'll level the quickest, I would think. And then we can level Rattata later, I think. Right. Thinking about it, I'm actually going to head back to the Pokemon Center and end there, because I need to hit my guys anyway, so... Speeding a little bit, just because it's got a pretty boring wall. So yeah, I think um, for our first episode, it was, was quite good. We got free, we got free Pokemon already, and um, yeah. So that is it, I suppose. Um, question of the day: We're gonna have a little question because a lot of people like to do that. Which of the three stars would you have chosen? Because obviously I've gone for Bulbasaur, but what would you guys have gone for if you had the option? Anyway, so thanks for watching, guys. Bye.